they cut the video off. <laughs> and I was upset about thinking that the baby inside of me was dead. I was upset. <laughs> and so he was being violent with my son. <laughs> After I thought that he killed the baby and me in the apartment. And I loved him so much. And he just continued to be violent, clinging like this with my baby. And he slung my baby. He was pulling his leg. When I was trying to get my son from him and the man was trying to restrain him, Austin grabbed my son's foot and tried to snatch him, his foot. He tried to rip my son's leg. And I was held up trying to hold him. And the man was trying to restrain Austin because he had just attacked me and Austin grabbed my son's leg and tried to rip it. <laughs> and that's when I went to get the, the gun off the table. <laughs> and I had taken it out because I was scared. <laughs> because I tried to get the help. <laughs> When I came into the restaurant asking the man to help me. But by this point, Austin was showing that he didn't even care about public places, that he would still attack me in a public place. And I pulled the gun out at this point because, because I was afraid. And then I went three, I almost pulled my baby's leg out. Like when he tried to rip his leg, I, sh I grabbed the gun and I still tried to get the baby from him before I shot it and he was still being violent with him. So I shot it in the air in the restaurant while we were trying to get the baby from him. And he started being more violent with him. And he started squeezing his rib cage, squeezing my baby's rib cage, and slung him up and started squeezing his rib cage. And the man was still trying to help me. And I put the gun to Austin's leg, right to his leg. And I grabbed my son with the other.